What you think about this rainy weather? It's not fair. <laughs> Yeah, good morning in that. It's Uncle Lou here. Yeah, that's right, it's me, Uncle Lou. Trying to make sure I don't fall down these stairs while I'm live for you on YouTube today. Thanks for watching, though. Really appreciate it. Yeah, officer friendly, man. It, it just, you know, I'm trying to speed to get, get somebody speeding back there. I guess there's no crime here, so they're reduced to hiding on the side of the road. He's probably watching a red box movie in there on his laptop. Anyway, good morning in that. It's Uncle Lou here. Uh, yeah, that's right. It's me, Uncle Lou. Live for you on Lou Tube today. So thanks for watching. Really appreciate it also in two. In addition to that as well. Uh Saturday. Um, of course, no live show today. I, I tried to mention that a bunch of times during the week, so people weren't tuning in this morning looking for the live show and then wondering why it's not there uh or whatever but um so i mentioned it a couple of times i was going out of town but i did want to get on here and uh talk about the army navy game a little bit I, it seems like i make basically the same uh basically the same video every year uh, about the army navy game I, i'm gonna make it again this year also in two uh my glasses are falling down uh, yeah, 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 I'm gonna make it, uh, I'm gonna make it this year, too. Uh, I watched the Army-Navy game every year, and I can remember, I, I, I only have, I guess, a few memories of, like, being really little and watching college football. Not that I didn't watch it, but very few things, I, I guess, stick in my head still, now that I'm getting old, uh... But I remember, um, I, I remember watching the Army Navy game every year as a kid. I, I guess because it's always been, uh, you know, this this week of the year, basically, where, uh, you know, after all the other games were played, and it's basically the only game on. And anyway, I just remember watching it every year, and uh, and and you know, the all the the. the the uh, cadets and, and all what I'm going to get, whatever they're called, in the stands with the uniforms on. And Anyway, I, I just remember watching this game every year as a kid. Uh, and so I'll watch it again today. And uh, the Army-Navy game is is different for me. You know, usually when I watch football, I'll, I have a, I'll pull for one team or another for one reason or another. Um, you know, like an SEC team or Georgia, obviously, or... Uh, you know, maybe I just want a certain team to win or whatever. Well, the Army Navy game—that's I don't know. That's not why you watch. Like you watch the Army Navy game, and you wish it. You just wish there was a way both teams could win, right? You don't really want anybody to lose this game, unless you're in the Army or an Army vet, or in the Navy, in a Navy vet. In which case, hell, you could go one and eleven. And as long as this was the game you won, you'd be happy, right? But uh, watch this game today. If, if, if this is a game that you've never really paid attention to before never really tuned into before uh watch this game today this is always um it's a special game there's a lot of uh you know ceremony and you know it, it, just watch the game if you haven't but as far as who's gonna win I, I i think navy's gonna win i was a little disappointed in army this year they've had a couple of pretty good years in a row i think they went 10 and 3 last year or 11 and 3 something like that and finished ranked a little down this year and Navy, on the other hand, has been uh, a good team this year. And I, I don't know, I have a feeling they'll find a way to win it. Um, but down here at the beach, uh, Tybee Island, if you've been watching Uncle Lou videos for a long, long time, uh, then you might recognize some of this. I, I think way back in 2015 or 2016, might have even been 2014. I made I, I made a couple of videos from this same spot down here one summer, but uh, my family has been coming to this same place here during the summer for um, years and stayed in this same uh, stayed in this same place uh, right there uh, 
for a long, long time. And uh, this was this was my mom's. This was probably that. Well, not probably. This was my mom's favorite place on earth. She loved it here. Uh, I'm not really sure why. I've never been a huge fan. I'll be honest. Uh, hold on a second. Maybe I'll cut that out if I remember. If you're seeing this, that means I didn't remember. I've never been a huge fan of Tybee Island. It's nice if you, if all you really want to do is sit on the beach and uh, and go out to eat. Other than that, there's not a whole lot to do here. My mom absolutely loved it down here. And uh, like most of you know, uh, it was a year ago this week uh, that my mom passed away unexpectedly, out of the blue really. Uh, you know, about a week before Christmas last year. And so uh, we've been planning this for a long time to come down here this week and spend, uh, or this weekend and spend a few days down here. So my dad's down here, Mrs. Lou, my kids, my brother, his wife, his kids um, are down here for two or three days. And, uh, but it, it's been good though. Um, and I wasn't real sure how it would go down here or how, you know, how my dad would, handle it or the kids even but it's been nice we just got here yesterday and we'll be here um, you know tonight a little bit tomorrow and then we'll come home but um, anyway I miss you mom I love you and uh, you know wish you were here and we know you are here guys don't take anything for granted I mean especially this time of year I guess but any time of year uh, make sure you you know the people you love make sure you let them know uh, y'all enjoy the Army Navy game and I'll talk to y'all later